With Valentine's Day right around the corner, I figured it'd be a great time to make an updated, quicker version of our adorable Valentine's Day gnomes. So you're gonna start off by placing a beer down on your rock because it's gonna need two coats. Usually the white needs two coats. I do like to stroke vertical stripes, kind of like how hair would grow as I'm placing the white. That way, if any rock does show through, it kind of goes into the beard. Next, you're going to add on your hat. Now, you can make these as pointed or floppy as you want, but we're just going to go with the basic shape here. I know my hand's in the way. I promise I get it out of there. I like to leave space for a nose and eyes. You can make the space smaller if you only want a nose. For this hat design, we're going to fill in with hearts. So I'm just making some outlines of hearts on here first before I fill in with red. It will just make it so I most likely won't have to do a double coat of whatever color I'm putting inside. Then I'm filling it in. Next, we're gonna come back and add a little bit of gray into our beard. I don't like them to be plain white, so a few stripes of gray and then come right back in with your white. Again, I'm using vertical stripes so that it's kind of in the direction the hair would be flowing. Just wispy little lines to just get some variation of color in there. When you're done, doodle off the tip of your pen on a white piece of paper until it's flowing white again. When your red is dry, you can go in and fill in your hearts. You can see I did white hearts above as well. You can mix these up a lot of different ways. And then I'm also going to create this cute little dot pattern. There's so many different things you can do with these. That's why I'm sharing the other gnomes in the background here so you can see some other fun ideas. Go back in and add in a couple little shoes sticking out the bottom of your beard as well. We're going to fill in our face space and then give it a nice big round nose that hangs over the beard a little bit. Grab one of your corresponding colors to add a little heart right in the center. Make sure your white's fully dry. And I also like to leave just a little spot that's white for a little highlight. Now I'm using Micron pens for the lining on these because I want the extra fine tip detail. Just be careful using these on rocks. You don't want to use a lot of pressure. You can wear down the tips and they're not cheap, but you get these super fine lines. I'm going with more of a sketch style on here so you don't have to be super straight. Um, I also added on a couple hands there. A few wispy lines in the beard for details as well. And that's it really, these are done. So mix and match, play around with your design ideas. You could make the heart bigger with somebody's name if you wanna personalize it as well. Here's some more Valentine's Day rock painting ideas for you to keep you inspired. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss our next fun rock painting tutorial. Bye-bye.